Hey guys, so I'm asking you here today. Today I am in Bloons TD5, so also known as Bloons Tower Defense 5. So uh, right now I'm going to be going on the new map. So I'm just going to be starting out on easy. I'm not going to go for no lives lost or anything like that. All I'm going to do is I'm just going to try and play through the map all 50 rounds without dying. So I have a feeling it's going to be pretty easy. It's a water map. I usually like using my water towers. Actually, I really usually like doing that. But, yeah. I, I can't be guaranteed that I'll win for sure. So let's just pop down a little spike shooter right there. Or attack shooter, whatever you call them. Uh, let me actually look what it's called. Uh, attack shooters. Yeah, I should know this by now. I mean, I pretty much already knew it, but I, I just wanted to be sure. I just wanted to be sure. Um, okay, so one balloon's getting through. That's kind of annoying. Let's just pop out. Ruin his day. You're not going to get through. Or you. So, already we're having some problems with our defense. So let's me upgrade this guy twice. And if I can upgrade him one more time for like 400 bucks, then he turns into like something that's like really good. And believe me, that upgrade is really good. I don't know what you call like fourth, but okay. We're gonna block them both. If there's any more that decide to come, they'll probably die too. Let's see, can I upgrade this guy in any way? I don't think I can really. Okay, there's just so many balloons that get through. I shouldn't have probably put that double. Um, Spike Shirt is doing his job. Uh, you there just in case. Thing is, I need to buy upgrades, but I don't have enough money, and I don't think there is really any room for banana farms. I mean, I need to actually save up some money, but I, I'm really bad at doing that. I mean, I'm usually really good at getting banana farms in this game, but oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, ah, uh, whatever, we already lost a life, it doesn't really matter. You don't get any rewards like Blood Monkey City. I think you should actually, though, but. Sadly, we don't. So we got grape shots. Those are quite good. They can like clear a whole screen. Don't have any lead popping power or any uh, what do you call it? Camo. All right, all right. So let me just talk about something on mobile. Just like uh, yesterday, I think. It's only like one video about this or so. Uh, I'm not planning to make one because the only thing I have is a screen recorder on my tablet. Is actually just like a really bad one. Mobilated or whatever. I mean, it's a good, it's a good screen recorder. Don't get me wrong, but uh, something I don't like is it always has that watermark on my old tablet, which just recently broke. Uh, I did something in the settings, and for some reason it didn't show the watermark. But I did the exact same thing in this one, and it just didn't. It was like, no, you're gonna have to watermark no matter what. So that's kind of a bummer for that. But yeah, let me tell you about it. I don't really know what it is. So I was just randomly playing the track map, like hoping to see a gold tune. I have no idea what I do with it. I didn't have a really good defense. I had a whole bunch of banana farms there, which reminds me. I should probably get a banana farm right about here or something and upgrade it. So I was just doing a good job, just defending barely actually, but um, I was getting a whole bunch of money. And I saw the I saw the gold loan on round like 37, let's say. I saw it on like round 37, and I really had no idea what to do with it. I tried to pop it, and like I didn't have any defense. It was like a lead balloon. I put down a whole bunch of spikes. Literally nothing happened. It didn't make me lose any lives or anything. But yeah, I don't, I don't really know what it was. So too bad there isn't any. One more thing, like I'm just speaking about the game I'm playing right now. Uh, too bad there isn't any like support next in this because I don't think there's any helicopters at all. Or just in general, any way to actually get lives back. So I'm gonna put down a spike shoot right there because I'm definitely gonna need it. Uh, they're still breaking through somehow. I don't know how. Okay, so let's upgrade to banana plantation. Okay, so spike. So now the camos are coming in. I'm actually gonna save it for a wizard. Actually, I have enough. So I don't know where to place them. I think I'm gonna place them just like right here. Yeah, good spot. Just can pop every single one. That spike factor isn't doing its job that well. I mean, it's clean out spike like it's supposed to be, but it's just not doing it fast enough. So, I'm gonna upgrade it bigger. Oh, yeah, there it goes. So now it can actually pop legs. 
And I don't really like submarines in this game. I don't really like submarines in any of the games, really. Uh, but they're okay to use, I guess. So I might actually lay down a few of them, because they can't do a lot sometimes. I just don't really like them that much. So, I don't know if I should get a monkey village or anything like that. Anything too crazy. That's not really crazy at all, though. So I'm just going to place them right here. Uh, let me see. Oh, I was playing this game a few days ago, and I unlocked a whole bunch of upgrades uh, for the for the submarine. I guess it's like safe for some reason. That's kind of stupid. I don't know why. I, I did get some, like, awesomeness or whatever in the lab. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I'm getting crazy. Spam spikes. Okay, I'm really down to a lot of lives. Uh, we're only around 32. I don't think we're going to start with the mob even. So let's try and get the destroyer. That should be a whole bunch of guns. Oh, yeah, there we go. So this thing is hardly a thing. Like XP really slow, it isn't any at all. But Spike Factory, thank you very much for doing your deed. I'm gonna put it so it does releases spikes like really fast. Ooh, camo. I mean, these guys can probably, the Spike Factory can probably handle them. But I definitely need deed needs some, like good camo defense, other than just Spike Factory. Uh, so next round, I'm actually gonna save it. And just if you die, which I'm pretty afraid of, maybe will die pretty soon. Um, I'm just gonna save it, so just in case I need to come back. I feel like a little baby. So I'm just gonna actually uh, turn off the sound of the pops and everything. They get kind of annoying. The music, I really like the music. But I don't really like the popping noises. Like, I mean, I don't like the no I mean, the popping noises I can handle, just not the lightning bolt and everything like that. Then it gets kind of annoying. So, I think I am going to get the monkey village. But I don't know where to put it. Like, there's no room anywhere. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh, just everything. Okay. Whatever, then maybe I'm going to get a super monkey. Yeah, I'm going to get the super monkey. Yeah, I got this. So I'm going to get the super monkey right about here. And then I'm going to save up for the monkey village. And then I'm going to put it right next to super monkey. Upgrade him so we can see camos and stuff like that. And then it should be pretty good. So there we go. Got the monkey village. Now let's just upgrade a few times. Um, let's go for beacon. And I'll save up for... Let's go for a 2-2 monkey village. 2-2 uh, monkey villages are pretty good. Because I always forget what can actually defend from camos and leads. So I think, there we go, got enough money for the those things. Oh gosh, all the balloons are just getting through. Not getting through just yet because of the spike factory, but pretty close to getting through. Speed up a little bit and try and upgrade this a little bit more. So we just need a radar scanner now. I'm not exactly sure what that does. Oh gosh, we're almost out of life. So I'm gonna save right here again just in case we do die. So it's not saving for some reason. Oh, there we go. It's saved. Finally. So, the mob is going to come out pretty soon, and I think that's how we're going to die. So let's actually upgrade to, like, these balls, because they do a lot of damage. And they also help out a lot. So let's get the radar now. Oh, I level up, actually. That's pretty cool. So we already got the radar. Let's try and get to round 50, then. Okay, so all these camo... All, okay, so that's definitely doing something. So I'm gonna go for range on that guy. Probably not gonna get, like, a sun god or anything crazy. It's because I hardly have any rounds. Okay, so I did die. But I'm going to go to menu. And I'm gonna go play... New game and just go to load game. That's the good thing about saving the game. You don't have to start completely all over. Oh, but... Look. My lives. My lives didn't go anywhere. Let's try and get the double uh, upgrade so we can get tons and tons of range. Um, what should we get next? I'm gonna go for Monkey Sense so he can see camos too. That's always a pretty big problem. So I'm gonna actually see how my sums, 
my subs doing? It's not doing that well. Ooh. Slow down a whole bunch here. Don't need to actually get that many things. Uh, three rounds and the mob comes. That's gonna be a pretty big problem, I know. So I'm gonna put down another bucket here. This is the round I died on last time. I think I should have saved. Okay, so... Intermediate. Let's try this again. Wait. No, I'm not, I don't want to do that. I want to load game. So here we are again. Oh yeah, I need these. Need the big spikes. Big spikes are quite good. I need to collect all the monies. Here we go, got the spikes. I mean the balls spikes. So from now on, every round I'm going to save, because I really need to save like every round. So now I'm going to get another buccaneer right here. We're making progress. We saved a little bit earlier. I don't know if I should. I guess I must. I might have to spam these. Uh, nope. I guess not. Let's save it again. And yeah, let's get going. And. Ooh. See, we always done that round. So, good thing is we saved. And we should be able to load the game. So, I keep on dying. It's a hard map, though. So we saved it on the round that we always die on. Just get tons of this. There we go. Actually, I'm going to speed up a little bit, then I am going to slow it down. It's usually these ceramic blends, so I'm just going to spam everything. I'm just going to use it all up. There we go. We actually beat that round. So that took a long time to do, but we're going to save it right here. Just in case another hard round comes up. So I'm going to go get these. Uh, Pretty good. Yeah, it shoots out a whole bunch. So we got the got both almost all. We got both zero three upgrades in these. I don't know if they're zero threes. No, they're not zero threes. I don't think. Wait, gosh. Uh oh. Yeah, I need to. There we go. Get that. Laser vision is always good to use. So kind of sub. Yeah, it's not gonna probably level up in this video. We have five more rounds. Oh, next round's actually the mob, so you could be in pretty big trouble, but I think these are just gonna just totally destroy him. But we did have some troubles with the ceramic balloons. Uh, so we could actually die. So I saved it right there. Here comes the mob, all big and strong, acting all proud. Oh yeah. We're not gonna just spam him, spam him. Oh we didn't Oh, we lost two lives. It's not, it's not bad at all. So, we got past that round. We have a few more rounds to actually go. Can I, I need to, oh gosh, no, I need to, I need the road spikes. Oh my god. So, we're definitely making progress because we did save it. So, I'm going to save it right here. Get another buccaneer. We need as many of these as possible. Grape shots, a 2 2 1. And just go to the spikes at the very end here. So I'm just clicking as fast as possible. Go. Hope these aren't disappearing. Okay, so it shouldn't be a problem now. Yeah, there we go. We got the. We beat the round, and we're gonna save again. Really quick save, and we're gonna get going again. So I'm gonna go range on this guy. Double range. It's the 1 2 super monkey. Pretty good super monkey. It can definitely defend from a few mobs, I think. Not alone, but with help, he can definitely do it. So we're almost here. It just surprised me how many times I died on this map already. It is pretty hard map. There's not that much land to put stuff on. But buccaneers should be pretty good, but surprisingly they're not that good actually. So I don't know. I'm gonna try and get another super monkey. They're always good to have. Uh, yeah, just put him on the rock here. Ooh, it died. Oh, round 49, too. So, good thing with that we did save the game again. Let's see, what round do we end up on this time? We end up on round 49. Save it right here. And let's put our super monkey down right away. So we have just enough money to get road spikes if we need them. Okay, I'm gonna collect the money every once in a while. It's like, okay, spam them. Here we go. Okay, we didn't lose that many lives. Uh, lost a few for sure. Uh, I shouldn't be doing that actually. I should just be more smart like this. And more range. So there we go. Round 50, the final round. Here 
comes a mob. Ooh, no. Okay, did we survive? I think we basically survived the round. Okay, it's only ceramics, which we definitely can handle. A mob. Uh, this does not look good that good. Okay, we actually did it. So we leveled up our sub too. And we got the bronze medal. So, uh,. I might keep playing in free play mode, but anyway guys, I'm going to end the episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe to join the Master Force today. Anyway guys, bye bye!